um, and welcome if you are the first time, if you this is the first video that you watched of mine, thank you for being here and um, I would just like to ask if you could just go and watch some of my other videos, subscribe if you want to and I'll subscribe back. Um, but this is the look that I did today. Um, what do you guys think? I use um, the Bon Bon palette, I use the Roses palette, uh, and I just, you know, I use some other things, but you gotta watch the video to, to see what I used. I really wanted to do this video today. I know I just posted one yesterday, but I really wanted to do this video today because yesterday's video was such a big mess, like, um, I just wasn't happy with it. So if I'm not happy with it, then how could anybody else be happy with it? So um, I'm like so sorry for yesterday, but I really wanted to do this today to make up for that. So I'm pretty sure that um, it's good. All the clips are there, all the footage is there. There's nothing missing. So yeah, I'm going to edit this right away and get this up for you guys. So um, if you um, want to see how I did this look, then keep watching. Um, at the end, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe, and I love you all, and um, I hope you enjoy. Okay, bye. Hey, um, well, today um, I am going to be doing um, a much better video than um, yesterday's. I feel really bad, like it was bugging me all night last night. I know it's nothing to really be like upset about, you know, it's just a video, but it is to me. Um, it felt like I maybe took a couple steps backwards with that video. Um, yeah, I'm just not too happy about it. So I am here to try to redeem myself. Um, so yeah, I am going to, to be today. Oh, I'm going to be today. Okay, talk much? Probably not. Um, today I'm going to be doing... Um, a much better look. Um, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Bon Bon palette um, along with the Roses palette because I find that they go really good together. And then I'm going to be using this Hard Candy palette. It's the, the Shadow Spheres. It's like the little balls on them, like you see. And then I'm just going to be using this really, really nice, um, I guess it's almost like a champagne shimmery color. Um, I'll show you. I don't know if you can see it. Oh yeah, you can see it. It's kind of really not the best to light. Oh yeah, you see it? Ooh, that is so pretty. So yeah, I'm going to be using that um, in the inside of my eyes, um, under my brow bone right here, and just a bit um, other places on my eye. And also, today I got in the mail, I got my Morphe brushes, my April Morphe brushes. I know that it's not April no more, but I, and I ordered them. I think it was around the 25th or 26th I ordered them, so it took a little bit of a while, so, but that's okay. Oh, I am so in love with these brushes. So I got these ones now, and I got this one. And I got this one and this one. So this is my Morphe um, brush collection so far. I am just ex like ecstatic about this. Like I want, I want the whole collection. I want every single brush. So that's what I'm working for. So that's what I'm going to be using today. I'm going to be using the Morphe brushes. Where did I throw it before my my oh my my little setup almost fell down. Okay, so what I used was <clears throat> a Maybelline, it's the new Dream Lumi, the um, Touch Highlighting Concealer. It just comes like with a brush and you twist it and it comes up like that. So I put it around on my face. Um, I'm going to be using my new Real Technique sponge. I'm just going to spray it down just a bit with the new Hard Candy. Um, it's the new Hard Candy Hydrating Mist. I need to get the other one. Okay, so. Hey, today. So what I'm going to use is I'm going to use my um, Physician's Formula um, foundation today. I really like this stuff. It's And plus it's like cute, cute packaging. Okay, 
Get a little, get a hair in my eye. I can't wait to just get, oh, and I ordered the unique foundation too. Can't wait to get that. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put it on my sponge. I just need to get a better um, foundation brush. I can't wait to get the one from um, Morphe. If they, do they even have one? I'm not even too sure. So the reason why people say to do foundation under concealer is that it says the bright, the brightening, the bright, brightening, the brightness comes through um, from under the foundation, and it kind of like helps like cover more. Like if you have dark circles, um, things like that. It's um. This is what people have said that if you have imperfect, imperfect. Okay, I don't know what's up with my language today. I hope you understand what I'm saying. But people have said that if you have in the per affections, try to put the con uh, concealer under the foundation because it helps hide things a little bit better. Um, I'm just gonna. I'll tell you right away how I feel about it. You know what? Hmm. Okay, so first initial reaction and review is I really like it. I, I think I am going to start doing it this way. I have heard people Sorry, I have something in my eye. I feel like I'm getting like little hairs in my eye. I don't know what though. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to start doing it this way because I find, I'm finding right now that um, like my under eyes, they, um, the bags aren't so intense and the um, the, the brightening that I like to have under my eyes is still there, even though I put foundation over top. I think I'm going, I'm not, I usually put, do, start with my hula, but I think I'm going to start with, um, this color. It's a really, really, really light purple. I think I'm going to start with that since I'm doing, um, like the bonbon and the roses. And I'm going to take this in the roses. I'm going to take this bit of a darker purple right there and get my under eyes with that. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take that and just put it right in this crease, right in the big, like, in this corner. I can make like a V. permanently I'm not too sure yet so what I'm gonna do is go in with black current it's the dark um, it's the dark purple in the bonbons palette I'm 
And I'm just gonna stay right in here. I'm not gonna get like crazy with it. See like just a bit of a smoky eye. I find me using Morphe brushes. Oh, kind of got a little crazy there. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take um, Divinity, it's the, this one down here, and I'm going to put that just underneath my um, eyebrow bone. I'm going to use my MAC brush like I always do. All right, so what I went ahead and did is I just did my eyeliner, both eyes, and then I just added, um, I used the Urban Decay um, Glide On 24-7 Eyeliner in Black um, in Perversion, so um, I love it because once it's on, it stays on. It doesn't like smear around or anything. The only time it really comes off is you start wiping your eyes, and I really don't start doing that until uh, late in the night, so before I start taking it off. So yeah, I'm, that's where I am right now. Um, so basically what I'm going to do now is bake with my Ben Nye Banana Powder. And then I'll do my eyebrows while it's baking. So, here we go. So yeah, of course, now that I'm wearing black, Grandpa. So what I'm going to do now is um, do my brows. Um, I always do my brows while the baking is baking. So um, I use the NYX Sculpt and Highlight. This is my holy grail. This is my go-to. I love it.
adjust it around on mine. Um, forehead. Excuse me, holy cow, I'm excited there. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is put to use my NYX. Um, actually, no, I'm not going to use my NYX. But I think I'm going to use that. I love the smell of this. Okay, so I'm going to take my, oh, this is my old faithful. I just love this um, contour brush. It's not even a brand name. It's like that, I don't know. I don't know why I like these little headbands. I think it looks alright on me. I need to change my nail color too. It's like getting old now. Like, oh my god, look. I don't know if you can see it. It's so girly. <clears throat> Alright, so. I'm going to use. In the bomb of my hand blush. And I'm just going to use Cabana Boy today. Alright. That's all I need from there because I'm using my highlight and my next contour palette. brush for highlight but I think I'm going to stop using it for that I think I'm going to start using my M501 brush for highlight Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm done my mascara now, so one last thing that we need to do is um, do the lips. And for this, I just need to turn, or turn, <laughs> put my, um, put my, uh, whoa, no, don't do that. everywhere.
Yay. I think this look makes up for yesterday's big, huge mess up. What do you think? Tell me in the comments if this is a good, um, a good makeup video. I'm loving the look. I'm loving, I really had fun doing it today. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, um, if you like it, you know what to do. I don't have to tell you. And if you haven't um, subscribed, please subscribe, comment that you did, and I will subscribe to your channel right back as, like, as soon as I get the notification. I'm a really loyal follower. I'm a very loyal subscriber. I will never unfollow or unsubscribe or unlike or nothing um, for any reason whatsoever. So um, I hope that you enjoyed doing this look with me today, and um, I love you all, and I can't wait to uh, do my next video. Okay, bye.